After more than a year of collecting data, the James Webb Telescope continues to show some amazing views of space. CBS 17 Storm Team meteorologist Rachel Dunzing shares some of the latest imagery. Once again, the James Webb Telescope has brought back to Earth some fascinating imagery. So what you're looking at right now is a nebula. That's a cloud of gas and dust in space. This specific nebula is called the Ring Nebula, and it was formed by a dying star. These spectacular images were created by both a near-infrared camera as well as a mid-infrared instrument. A little complicated, but they are both part of the James Webb Telescope. Now remember, some of the light in space is in the infrared, so we need special equipment like what the Webb Telescope has to even see it with our eyes. So the mission of the telescope is more than just taking these spectacular pictures. It's about learning the history of our vast universe. Because yes, this imagery is absolutely beautiful to look at, but it also shows astronomers the final stages of this star as it was dying. Very fascinating things. Now, the Ring Nebula is considered close to Earth at 2,500 light years away. In the studio, meteorologist Rachel Dunzing, CBS 17.